two operators. You want to make sure that they don't give any more space. Playing for the corner, Carpe can stick this one, but he's still going to take about a tick of damage. Actually, no, even more. Oh. Fell so low as Mystic shows up, finds three kills on the hunt for more. Shorty in hand. Gets the tap, gets the finish. On for the ace. Excurrent has been noted. Oh. Oh, one suns him into the corner. How heavily do they want to go for it? Well, doesn't matter. Mystic has got it. Gets the aces, Enzo Ace. gets the defuse, and Team Liquid will lock in six round on that. Six rounds in this half. Mystic in prime condition today. So you know dead. he's had quite a storied career in Valorant as well, and, and a lot of fans of Mystic himself they ho they stayed the faithful. Oh, quick, 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 they said we still believe in this guy. Look at the oh, way they work these God. smokes against T1. I mean, the spray down, just holding it, assuming that they're going to be crowded around that entrance. I love that he even just was like, well, I'm going to destroy the rendezvous, even though it doesn't yeah. matter. It will get cleared, and that's going to be him TPing back. Now, though, T.L. can start pushing forward and garnering some space for themselves as Kago! Oh! Slows down three outside of C! Taking that back. Low HP remaining on him, but now has a showstopper available. Oh, and without and the spike getting planted, T1, they just have to wait. They don't know where it's coming from. They're not sure which direction it's going to be. Showstopper does get popped early. Keiko's suspecting that someone's still going to be hovering nearby, and he is correct and will be rewarded. Now is on for an ace. Potentially our second one here of this match. Holding the line, Excurit. One standing between them, but man, oh, oh. he's instantly gotten it. A second ace for TL. And a second round of Switching overtime. Side. Keiko oh, all time. alone on that C side. You know, they just left two. He's left after the pop flash comes out. T1 comes out swinging. Gets the spray down on three. And that just suddenly makes the round so much easier. Gets the anti-flash on his own. And Absolutely. The, oh, Gorgeous control. And the way they were set up too, right? Nat so far behind on mount draws all the attention. And Keiko able to just focus on his own shots. Boom. Spike now planted. The shot's nearly there. Nampi lucky to get away with that one with his life. Going out. Mystic again just taking a forward position here within his own smoke. But these are the things that can really make or break the round. He's just so low. The double push. It's going to be a very easy transfer, but now side player will be able to find the headshot, but so will Nat. He shuts down Carpe, trying to push in through Baby Door. Excret now taking a close angle. Swings in, but Nat's covering fire. Helps save his teammate's life. Showstopper at the ready. Sends it close. Side player on for an ace, and he will get it. Our third one of the map. Holy cow. As we go even deeper into this overtime. 14 to 14. What is going on overtime. between these players? Three aces, two of them in overtime, and man, Saya player, a heroic hold. I love what he does with the showstopper as well. Doesn't risk it. You know the Odin's still online. He could just start swinging and spraying at any moment's notice. So he just plays for the timing here, starts to hear it. He's waiting for that trigger, then swings back out. He will just be... Playing contact here, swinging forward and tries to send some shots in, but Carpe swift to sweep through. This man should get that punish. First kill going their way. Omen is not getting caught, Mystic not being found, but then Carpe eventually susses it out, spots him, takes him down. Yampi trying to play anti-flash, starts mowing them down! Oh. Finds three and strands the spike. Spike is stuck in a real bad spot. Yampi checking for mid, that's the only place he has to cover, his teammates have his back. Rossi maybe made a little bit of noise, but as he swings out, yeah, Yampi's gonna be able to take him out. Does he find the ace? Izu down so very low. Top gen. I mean, poor health. Team Liquid want Yampi to get this ace. That way, his no command comes online. Turret out. Looks like Izu's gonna swing in for it. The fourth one of this match. Yampi will find an ace, and that is gonna be TL getting themselves on the board. Four aces in this best of three. Absolute insanity. So much star power on these two rosters. And we're also just starting to see a lot of value, potential value from the Sky heal, right? I mean, they're able to constantly try to buy for these angles where you might shoot each other through the wall. And you can go for the recovery. Of course, this time Yampi's still there for good cover, gets the spray down. 
Take the gamble that it's the weaker side. No matter what, they're going to stick together. That was the main goal from the get-go. I mean, that one right there should let them know. Oh, what a one-tap! Oh! What a two-tap! The Carpe comes up with two quick kills! Sends out the Seekers! TP forward, Mystic gets himself over to Lumber, but now the rotations come through. Izo arriving with them from the shadows. No time. They fight down. There's oh. the flash in. Carpe on for oh Can he get the ace? One more shot. Carpe! Use it the new IGL steps up to the plate, aces them with a sheriff. What a critical swing round. Carpe with the sheriff on a scent. There's something there. Another iconic moment for the T1 squad. And these are the moments you want from your leader. I, these first two are just crisp, but then the Seekers immediately to buy time. Yampi unfortunately gets caught by his own flash as the screen goes down. And then you got teammates hyping you up as they should. With here, Mystic as well can try to shake things up. Does have that ult ready, but it's gonna be the Hunter Spearing. Straight off the rip, Izu falling low, but Rossi, Rossi mowing down three, gets himself four. Do we get another ace? Find there it. it is! Why the hell not? Ladies and gentlemen, ace number six in three maps of play as T1 take the lead. And the pop off from Rossi, flying halfway across the globe, leaving his mark already in Seoul, South Korea, as the newest member to the long-standing Korean team, T1. Surely this is a record now. It has to be. Six, six, <laughs> six in a best of three series. There's just no way. It feels like it's got to be unprecedented, at least at this level. I mean, it's an average of two per map. I, that's it's, just unheard of.